Sante kwa kuwezesha mimi kuja kulia ndugu yangu and I'm sure those who work with him share what I have shared to the family mulie na mungu sisi wote tutaenda but death is painful when you broke down I felt it even in John chapter 11 35 the shortest verse in the Bible says Jesus wept kwa sababu alikuwa pia na uzito when he lost his friend called Lazarus alipoona mother na Mary he broke down so it's not an easy thing lakini cry in Christ may God give you the strength to withstand all this Sorry for taking long, but I just had to say that about my part, departed friend, Lorenzo Asanteni Sano. Your Excellency, the Kazakh Zote, my colleagues have, have taken over and wamesema yale yote to Geasema. Lakini kwa sababu jana jioni tulikuwa na committee ila ilikuwa inapanga. Ani kakakikishia watu wa masabitu wale walikuwa wamekuja hapa. Nini kawambia kwa ba mimi I'm the senior Asha na mimi ni mzee wa Boma Na kwa hivyo nini ketaka kutabua eh, Kaute Commissioner Ndiyo watu wetu wa saburu wajua wa kwa ba wako na amani Na kuna amani hapa na ikiwa eh, mutakaa hapa hata leo jioni na kesho na kesho kutwa Mukai hapa mkua mkuna amani Wana County Commissioner can you wave That is Onesmas uh, yule di County Commissioner yetu Kwa hivyo kutuko na amani hapa ya, Yangu tu ni kusema jabu moja bili Eh, ya kwamba we have talked about eh, our brother and uh, yale ya mesemwa of man of humility hata wakati alikuwa mkubwa kule state house hata wakati anakuja kwa hii town yetu ugejua ya kwamba is of that kind of a big man na alikuwa sababu alikuwa na anakana kila mtu and he was a man to who demonstrate humility and humbleness even at the time of giving service Kwa mambo mengi tumekutana kwa kanisa He was doing great things to the church Na kwa hivyo sisi uh, On behalf of the people of Laikipia County Sisi tunataka kulakia familia Mwenyezi mungu aweze kuendelea na kumpatia guvu Na for me, Joan and Paulo Tafadhali continue uh, Studying with your mom And we continue playing And may God grant you his favor and grace And strength and comfort during this moment na tuko pamoja na nyinyi tutaendea na kusimama pamoja na nyinyi and for the rest of us let's learn from our brother that the great thing is is not the number of years that you have but is what you have done with your years in this country and therefore may god bless you may you do well na mimi nataka kwa wakati huu Mr. Governor, and his idea in a protocol. Your Excellency, Deputy President, Kuna representative wa former President Uhuru Kenyatta, Na Anaitua Ambassador Samuel Itonga. Kitonga, Ako, Ambassador Kuja Akrisha, former President. Excellency, the Deputy President, Honorable Rigathi Gashagwa, Your Excellency, Pastor Dokas Rigathi, the family of my friend and brother, Lawrence Leneapa, all leaders present here, the clergy, uh, distinguished guests, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Ambassador Samuel Gitonga, a long-time friend and colleague of Ambassador Leneapa. Before I convey the message, I'd like to say just one thing. I have known Ambassador Lawrence Leneapa for over 35 years. When he initially joined provincial administration with Honorable Leneapa, who is here today, in fact, one of the questions I was asking myself is, is Leneapa going to, is, sorry, is Letibaro going to be here? And I'm happy Mweshimiwa is here. When they joined provincial administration, I welcomed them. So I've known him all these years, and we went different journeys, but we all became ambassadors. I'll miss him dearly. Thank you. Now, I'd like to convey the message of His Excellency uh, Uhuru Kenyatta, the fourth president of the Republic of Kenya, and I convey. 
message of condolence to the family, relatives, and friends of the late Ambassador Lawrence Leneapa. It is with a, a deep sense of loss that I send you this message of condolence and encouragement following the death of Ambassador Lawrence Leneapa. Ambassador Leneapa's passing leaves a huge vacuum among us that will be hard to fill. To everyone who knew him or had the privilege of working with him, he was well respected as a calm, humble, kind, and courageous person. A strong, effective, and patriotic leader who served our nation without any reservation. His achievements, expertise as a refined administrator, public service spirit, and patriotism gave me pleasure to appoint him as my first controller at State House, where he served diligently from 2013 to 2018, and later as Kenya's ambassador to the Netherlands. He served with distinction in both offices, and his loss will, be, will certainly be felt. It is worth noting that Leneapa star did not start shining with his appointment as State House Controller and later Ambassador. His diligence, determination, and focus actually saw him climb the ladder of leadership much earlier. Upon joining the public service at a young, younger age, he rose through the ranks in the then provincial administration to the position of district commissioner and later promoted to the, provincial, to the position of principal secretary for environment and mineral resources. Indeed, his enormous influence and outstanding ability inspired other public servants into dedicating themselves to offering better and quality service to the citizens of Kenya. During his tenure as State House Controller, Leneapa spearheaded the implementation of various development projects, as well of, as, as well as overseeing the smooth and efficient running of state houses and lodges countrywide. I know that Leneapa's death leaves a gap that will not be filled, certainly not by these few words of consolation. But let us be grateful that he lived his life well and has left an indelible mark on the lives of all those who had the opportunity to interact with him. As we mourn the late Ambassador Lawrence Leneapa, let us be consoled and lifted by, his exemplary, by the exemplary life he led. My thoughts and prayers are and remain with you at this time of great sorrow and grief. I pray that the Almighty God will give you strength and courage to bear the loss. May Almighty God rest his soul in eternal peace. Signed, His Excellency Uhuru Kenyatta, CGH, the fourth President of the Republic of Kenya. Uh, as I invite uh, our two CSs, and uh, CS uh, Soipan will invite and give a minute to the other uh, Florence, CS Florence, uh, a space to speak a word or two. Kwa Gutu Kwa Deputy President, CC on behalf ya watu wa Raikipia. Tunataka kukushukuru. Tumekuona last week you were together with us. Likuja kukagua Milandi. Na leo uko pamoja nasi. Hii ni ishara moja kwamba usimami na sisi wakati tu wa maendeleo hata wakati wa majozi unakuja kusimama na sisi. Kwa hivyo tunataka kukurudishia shukurani on behalf of the people of Raikipia and of course on behalf of the people of Lendile Kule Masabit kwa sababu ya kusimama na mmoja wetu. Kwa hivyo tunakushukuru na tunataka kukulakia mema tukiendelea na kushikilia hii serikali na tuendelea na kukuombea as we continue serving the great people of this Republic of Kenya. Na kwa hayo, niluhusu na ruhusa yako, niite CS wetu, Soipan, aweze kusema jabu moja bili, alafu labda atapatia huyo mwingine nafasi, alafu ni mpatia hiyo nafasi kukualika the Deputy President. Asante sana, karibuni. Asante sana, Governor Irongo. Uh, Your Excellency.